Hello! I found out the other day you can actually make meringues out of the liquid you drain off a can of chickpeas. It's called aquafaba and you can use it instead of egg white, not as well as egg white because that would be a little bit odd. Actually it's a little bit odd anyway. If you're a vegan or you just are avoiding eggs or you just want to experiment then you can do this too even though I don't know what I'm doing and this is the first time I've tried it and as you're watching it this is honestly I haven't tried it before so it might work. So you're going to need chickpeas, cream of tartar, caster sugar which is just like very fine sugar, not icing sugar but very fine flavouring. I've got vanilla essence here. You can do something else I suppose. I suppose you could use brown sugar but it's not as thin and I'm not sure what I'm doing so it might not work. So first of all what you have to do is drain the liquid, the water from the chickpeas. So I'm going to do that here now. What I'm left with is this. So it says use six tablespoons. I suppose I've sort of got, that's what I've got here anyway. 150 grams of sugar, maybe less sugar. I'm gonna, 150 grams is about uh, three quarters of a cup. I'm not sure that much yeah so I'll put that in and then I'll put the liquid in and then I'll put the flavoring afterwards okay so this this might go all horribly wrong now I'm using this thing which is I got it from the ideal home exhibition and it's supposed to go really whiskey and you're supposed to be well it looks like egg white that doesn't it that's amazing anyway so what I'll do is I'll put all of the sugar except for a little bit I'll keep a little bit back because I think there was too much anyway so right so Know whether this will work, whether it will work. Whiskey, 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 whiskey. It does look like egg white. Right? So you keep going for ages and ages and ages. Ooh, it's really weird though that something from chickpeas does the same thing as egg. Then again, they are called chickpeas and chickpeas, they look a little bit like chickens and the liquid does the same thing as chicken eggs. Magic. Anyway, I'm, I don't think they're related to chickens. I don't think vegans need to be worried about that to be honest. But Look, this how it's coming along, look. It's worked, it's actually worked. I can't believe it, I'm gonna taste it a minute. Because it's not made with eggs, it's safe to eat without cooking it. So, mmm, it's like marshmallows. So you could use this as like a, a cake topping or a pie topping or just has, just, just eat it from the bowl. But what I think I'm going to do is make actual meringues and put them in the oven with some of it. I might keep some of it and just eat it with the spoon because it's really nice. So it's getting really stiff now. This is grease proof paper. If you've got an icing bag, you can do them that way. But I've got a clean spoon and I'm just gonna do simple meringues like that. I've researched several different places, so there's not one place where this recipe is. This is me deciding from lots of different ones what's best. And asking some people that have made them as well who assure me that it would work and I still wasn't sure they were telling the truth but I'm an awful lot more confident now I've got clean fingers don't worry so I'm going to fill this tray with them so you should do them for about 45 minutes at 130 maybe and then leave the oven closed for them to set a little bit longer after that Hopefully they're not going to melt into one. Just maybe do one more and I'm just going to save the rest as 
eating with the spoony things. Oh, I've got a bit much on there, hang on. And here they are, out of the oven. I think that one's the best. So I've put some fruit in a bowl. There's raspberries and strawberries and black currants and blueberries and cherries. And I'm going to put a meringue on each of them and I'm going to finish it off with some of the uncooked meringue. So I've got a lovely dessert and I've also got some lovely hummus which I'm probably going to have with some crudite, some maybe cucumber and carrot and also maybe some tortilla chips, something like that. I think that was a success, definitely. So, meringues, vegan meringues, big success. Bye bye.